Hey everybody, this is Peter. In this video segment, we're going to add a task with Sourcefire's IPS. So what we want to actually show you in this video is how you can accomplish simple things like, um, you know, a backup schedule and add it into a calendar, which is actually built into the Sourcefire IPS or, or Sourcefire's Defense Center. It's really cool. Um, so what we're going to show you here, let's quickly log on here with our username and password. And you'll see actually how easy it is to do this and how um, granular it is in the actual interface of the device. So let's go into operations, tools, and then we'll go into scheduling. Now in scheduling here, you're going to see a bunch of options. You first see your calendar, which is really cool. It's actually built into the device or the GUI that is, right? Nice and easy. Take a look at that. And you click on add task. In here, you have the options from a drop down to choose a specific job. So you can basically say um, run a backup at X time, um, an Nmap scan, a Nessus scan, which is really cool, um, synchronize Nessus plugins, apply a policy, updates, all that good stuff. You know, push your latest update, you know, download it from Sourcefire and push it out at, you know, whatever time, you know, depending on, you know, the policies in your environment and how it works, you might have to push updates out at midnight or, you know, after hours, whatever it may be. So in our case here, we're going to do a simple one. Um, let's say, <clears throat> we can basically choose download the latest update and you know we can choose once or recurring we probably will probably want to do this recurring so we can choose recurring here and we'll wait until this refreshes and we can choose you know hour day repeat how often you know weekly monthly whatever it may be and we can say update the software and the vulnerability database and we'll go ahead and click on save Oh, one second, guys, we got a little error there. We've got to put an actual job name in here. It's not going to save properly. So put in the job name of update task or something, you know, stupid like that for the time being. We'll go ahead and save that. And now you'll see when we scroll down in our calendar that this job is now scheduled on a weekly basis on Sunday to update our software and our vulnerability database. That's pretty much all we wanted to show you in this video, guys. Thanks very much for coming out. See you on the next one.